If you think you can get rid of young male aggression, you are mistaken. You can pontificate all day long about how we must reduce violence in our society, but you're not going to stop fights between youngsters. <laughs> there! <laughs> there okay. yeah. I was referring to that. Uh, that's a high school fight club in California. A couple of lads, they put on the boxing gloves, they have yeah. a fight. They fight it out, okay? Right. Male aggression. Oh, outrage! You can't do that! That's violence in the schools. Nonsense, say I. Joining me now is Dr. Robbie Ludwig, who knows a thing or two about young male aggression. Do you know? Yes, I do. Well, I have a teen son, um, right. so I understand male aggression, and I understand about just humans in general. We are aggressive, but yes. it doesn't mean that it needs to get acted out in a violent way. <laughs> Wait a minute. Of course it does. No, no. Young teenage males have always gone up against each other, and they're usually fighting about a girl. You know that. But this what was... What are you going to do? Say, oh, no, oh, no, we've got to talk it out. We must I, do I'm this. not saying that, but this is this was organized. They yeah. were videotaping it. Yeah, so they were making themselves... They wore gloves. The they had rules. But you know what? Here's the, here's the reality about young teens. Their judgment is off because that part of the brain is not developed. Yeah. They're impulsive. Yeah. And when you are hitting another child, it could be very dangerous. So the fact that it is not supervised, you that's where parents and administration oh. comes in to you make the appropriate feminize intervention. feminize young men? They're not going to be feminized. And to think that violence equals masculinity is dangerous. Women are more aggressive probably than I'm men. Not, I'm not saying that. Yeah. I'm simply saying that you cannot change the human condition. No, and but, the you human condition it, is that young, but you can yes, channel it, but you can channel it. Boys were channeling it. I don't think so because it was unsupervised. Why can't it be oh, taken be in a supervised? Yes, that's that where adults come difference. in to make sure things <laughs> don't get too extreme. Get out of here. I would not want my son in a fight club. He's 16 years old. He takes it on the basketball court with his very masculine friends who are very appealing. They're not feminized because they're they're playing it out on the basketball court. Do you think you can stop young men fighting? I don't think you can stop it, but you can certainly impose a superego on your kids and say, should I be worried about you? Because you don't want kids taking it too far. They don't have the judgment in place. Totally wrong, but you know, Robbie, it was fun having you on the show. And I love listening to you with that accent. You can call me wrong anytime. <laughs> Thanks for being on the show. Good stuff.